Right now, wildfires are still burning in northern Minnesota. This is a look at the current situation, and we learned today investigators believe that the Jenkins Creek fire was started by a person. No further details have been given, but we do know more about how crews are fighting those flames, and one of our state's most precious resources is pitching in. In the fight to douse raging wildfires in northern Minnesota, our 10,000 lakes are coming to the rescue. We can get a lot of water onto a fire in a pretty short amount of time in a magnitude that really outperforms any other method. Airplanes like these rely on them to drop down, scoop up, and dump the water where it's desperately needed. When the time came, when these conditions started to prevail and those two major fires broke out, uh, they, they reached out to the Forest Service to make sure that they ordered us up, and we were able to dispatch at least within 24, 48 hours here from Bozeman, Montana. These 1,400-gallon tanks can drop hundreds of thousands of gallons of water in a four-hour cycle before refueling. Some also drop retardant to quell the flames. A very dangerous mission. These aircraft are flying, you know, as low as 100 feet above the ground to be effective and drop uh, water. Sam Davis's company, Bridger Aerospace, has been around the country helping local forces fight fires. This year alone, we've worked from the Carolinas to California on fires. We've been in 11 different states. To accomplish their mission here in Minnesota, they ask that you stay out of the way. There's already been 18 incidents this year with drones over fire that have gotten in the way and shut down aerial uh, operations for aircraft that are authorized to be there.